Good morning, everybody. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. O God, who restore us to eternal life in the resurrection of Christ, raise up Raise us up, we pray, to the author of our salvation, who is seated at your right hand, so that when our Savior comes again in majesty, those you have given new birth in baptism may be clothed with blessed immortality. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Please be seated for our first reading. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. One night the Lord spoke to Paul in a vision. Be fearless, speak out and do not keep silent. I am with you. I have so many people that belong to me in this city that no one will attempt to hurt you. So Paul stayed there preaching the word of God among them for 18 months. But while Galileo was proconsul of Archaea, the Jews made a concerted attack on Paul and brought him before the tribunal saying, we accuse this man of persuading people to worship in a way that breaks the law. Before Paul could open his mouth, Galileo said to the Jews, listen you Jews, if this were a misdemeanor or a crime, it would be in order for me to listen to your plea. But if it is only quibbles about words and names and about your own law, then you must deal with it yourselves. I have no intention of making legal decisions about these things. Then he began to hustle them out of the court. And at once they all turned on Sothenus and the synagogue president and beat him in front of the tribunal. Galileo refused to take any notice at all. After, say, after staying on for some time, Paul took leave and the, for the, of the brothers and sailed to Syria, accompanied by Priscilla and Aquila. At Kentrea, he had his hair cut off because of, vow, of a vow he had made. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. Lord. The response to the spam is, God is king of all the earth. God is king of all the earth. All you peoples, clap your hands. Shout to God with cries of gladness. For the Lord, the most high, the awesome, is the great king over all the earth. God is king of all the earth. He brings people under us, nations under our feet. He chooses for us, for us our inheritance, the glory of Jacob, whom he loves. God is king of all the earth. God mounts his throne amid shouts of joy. The Lord, amid trumpet blasts. Sing praise to God, sing praise. Sing praise to our King, sing praise. God is King of all the earth. Alleluia, alleluia. Christ had to suffer and rise from the dead and so enter into his glory. Alleluia. Thank you. Go back to your seats. Let's stand for the gospel. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Jesus said to his disciples, I tell you most solemnly, you will be weeping and wailing. While the world will rejoice, you will be sorrowful, but your sorrow will turn to joy. A woman in childbirth suffers because her time has come, but when she gives birth to the child, she forgets the suffering in her in her joy that a man has been born into the world so it is with you you are sad now but i shall see you again and your hearts will be full of joy 
and that joy no one shall take from you. When that day comes, you will not ask me any questions. The Gospel of the Lord. Please be seated. So, we watch the coronation of the king and the queen. It's over, that is past. And then Eurovision came. A lot of people from all over the world, a lot of music, a lot of partying, eating and drinking. It's all over. What happens next? People have to go back to work and get on with life. You cannot stay at that high level of partying and eating all the time. You get sick, you run out of money. So reality calls you to come back to your duty of state. Workers, students, you have exams to prepare, as it is the case with you now. You know, I've been told you are all preparing for your exams in a week's time. So forget about all that parting, you know, coronation is gone. Come back to reality and take care of yourselves, take care of your duties. We have to adjust, learn to adjust all the time. There is a time for everything. So you make that wise decision to concentrate that's the job you have at hand. This is the time for the exams. You have to prepare. So that, that is life. Keep adjusting all the time. That is what wise people do. So um, I would like us during this Mass uh, to pray for the intention that God will help you to prepare, concentrate, and remember what you have read, and to do well in the exams. So we all pray for that intention, uh, for God's assistance and blessing uh, for you to prepare for your exams well. Those doing the bidding prayers, please come forward. Pray for our school community and year 7, 8, 9 and 10 during their end of year exams. We keep the year 11s in our thoughts during their difficult GCSEs and year 11 and year 13s during A-levels. Help all of us stay focused and calm during the next few weeks. Lord, in your mercy. Hear our prayer. We pray for the environment. We ask for a greater awareness in our, school co in our local community about our contribution to pollution. Help us to become more mindful and take better care of the earth. Lord, in your mercy. Hear our prayer. We give thanks for diversity in our country, where everybody's culture is appreciated. We pray for equal rights for everybody in our country, because we are all God's children. Help us to celebrate our differences and embrace our cultures. Lord, in your mercy. Hear our prayer. We pray for all of the people who are struggling and don't feel safe in their own countries especially for the people in Sudan and Ukraine. We pray that all of the war ends, Lord, in your mercy. Hear our prayer. We pause for a moment to pray for all of our personal intentions. As we say, Hail Mary. Full of Holy grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and the hour of our death. Amen. Thank you. Go back to your seats, please. Those bringing the offer tree gifts, please do so. Place them on the altar.
Blessed are you, Lord, the God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread, bread, bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. <coughs> Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God the Almighty Father. Accepting compassion, Lord, we pray the offerings of your family, that under your protective care they may never lose what they have received, but attain the gifts that are eternal through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. Lift up your hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation at all times to acclaim you, Lord, but in this time above all to love you yet more gloriously when Christ our Passover has been sacrificed. He never ceases to offer himself for us, but defends us and never pleads our cause before you. He is a sacrificial victim who dies no more, the Lamb once slain who lives forever. Therefore overcome with Pascal joy, every land, every people exhaust in your praise. And even the heavenly powers with the angelic hosts sing together the unending hymn of your glory as they acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. O Sana in the highest, blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. O Sana in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith, we proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church, spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis our Pope and Mark our Bishop and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray. That with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, our spouse, with the blessed apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be coerced to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. At the Savior's command and form by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from. 
Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as you await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. <coughs> Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant a peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. The peace of the Lord be with you always. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I'm not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
body of Christ. God bless. Body of Christ. God bless. Body of Christ. God bless. God bless. Body of Christ. Body of Christ. Body of Christ, body of Christ. God bless. Body of Christ. Body of Christ. God bless. God bless you. God bless you. Body of Christ. God bless. Body of Christ. 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 God bless. God bless. Body of Christ. Thank you for your participation at Mass this morning, and thanks to the choir. Let us pray. Keep safe, O Lord, we pray, those whom you have saved by your kindness, that redeemed by the passion of your Son, they may rejoice in his resurrection, who lives and reigns forever and ever. The Lord be with you. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Go in peace, the Mass is ended.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Lord, open our lips. And we shall praise your name. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Christ the Lord has promised us the Holy the Spirit. Spirit. Come, let, let us adore him. him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come, ring out our joy to the Lord. Hail the God who saves us. Let us come before him giving thanks. With songs, let us hail the Lord. Christ, Christ the, Lord the Lord has, has promised, promised us, us the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Come, Come, let, let us adore, adore him. Alleluia. The mighty God is the Lord, a great King above all gods, and his Son at the depths of the earth. The heights of the mountains are his. To him belongs the sea, for he made it, and the dry land shaped by his hands. Christ, Christ the Lord has promised us, us the Holy Spirit. Spirit. Come, Come, let us adore him. Alleluia. Come in, let us bow and bend low. Let us kneel before the God who made us. For he is our God, and we the people who belong to his pasture, the flock that is led by his hand. Christ, Christ the, Lord the Lord has promised, has promised us the Holy Spirit. Spirit. Come, Come, let us adore him. him. Hallelujah. Oh, that today you would listen to his voice. Had it not your hearts as at Meribah, as on that day at Massar in the desert, when your fathers put me to the test, when they tried me, though they saw my work. Christ the, the Lord has, has promised us the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Come, Come, let, let us, us adore him. him. Hallelujah. For forty years I was wearied of these people, and I said, Their hearts are astray. These people do not know my ways. Then I took an oath in my anger. Never shall they enter my rest. Christ, Christ the Lord has, has promised us the Holy Spirit. Spirit. Come, Come, let, let us, us adore him. him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Christ, Christ the Lord, Lord has, has promised, promised us the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Come, Come, let, let us, us adore, adore him. him. Hallelujah. Have courage, my son. Your the sins, sins are, are forgiven you. you. Hallelujah. Have mercy on me, God, in your kindness. In your compassion, blot out my offense. Oh, wash me more and more from my guilt and cleanse me from my sin. My offences, truly I know them, my sin is always before me. Against you, you alone have I sinned. What is evil in your sight I have done? What you may be justified when you give sentence, and be without reproach when you judge. O oh, see, in guilt I was born, a sinner was I conceived. Indeed, you love truth in the heart, then in the secret of my heart teach me wisdom. O oh, purify me, then I shall be clean. O oh, wash me, I shall be whiter than snow. Make me hear rejoicing and gladness, that the bones you have crossed may revive. For my sins turn away your face, and blot out all my guilt. A pure heart create for me, O God, put a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, nor deprive me of your Holy Spirit. Give me again the joy of your help. With a spirit of fervor sustain me, that I may teach transgressors your ways, and sinners may return to you. O oh, rescue me, God, my helper, and my tongue shall ring out your goodness. O oh, Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For oh, in sacrifice you take no delight, burnt offering from me you would refuse. My sacrifice a contrite spirit, a humble contrite heart you will not spurn. In your goodness your favor to Zion, Rebuild the walls of Jerusalem, and then you will be pleased with lawful sacrifice, holocaust suffered on your altar. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, well without end. Amen. I courage, my son, son your sins are forgiven you. you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lord, you came with strength to save, save your, your people. people. You, you came, came with your, your anointed one. one. Hallelujah. Lord, I have heard of your fame. I stand in awe at your deeds. Do them again in our days. In our days make them known. In spite of your anger, have compassion. God comes from Timon. The Holy One comes from Amparan. His splendor covers the sky and his glory fills the earth. 
His brilliance is like the light. The rays flash from his hands. There his power is hidden. You march out to save your people, to save the one you have anointed. You made a path for your horses in the sea, in the raging of the mighty waters. This I heard and I tremble with terror. My lips quiver at the sound. Weakness invades my bones. My steps fail beneath me, yet I calmly wait for the doom that will fall upon the people who are sailors. For even though the fig does not blossom, nor fruit grow on the vine, even though the olive crop fail, and fields produce no harvest, even though flocks vanish from the foes, and stalls stand empty of cattle. Yet I rejoice in the Lord, and exalt in God my Saviour. The Lord my God is my strength. He makes me leap like the deer. He guides me to the high places. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Lord, you came, you come with strength, with strength to save, save your, your people. people. You, you came come with your anointed one. Hallelujah. Zion, praise your God. For he has established peace in on your land. land. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, praise the Lord, Jerusalem. Zion, praise your God. He has strengthened the bars of your gates. He has blessed the children within you. He established peace on your borders. He feeds you with finest wheat. He sends out his word to the earth and swiftly runs his command. He showers down snow white as wool. He scatters hoar frost like ashes. The hills down whalestones like crumbs. The waters are frozen at his touch. He sends forth his word and it melts them. At the bread of his mouth the waters flow. He makes his word known to Jacob, to Israel his laws and decrees. He has not dealt thus with other nations. He has not taught them his decrees. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Zion, praise your God, for he has established peace in your land. Alleluia. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. The God of our fathers raised Jesus from death. After he had killed, they, you had killed them by nailing him to a cross. And God raised him to his right side as leader and saviour to give to the people of Israel the opportunity to repent and have their sins forgiven. We are witnesses to these things, we and the Holy Spirit, who is God's gift to those who obey him. The Lord has risen from the dead, alleluia, alleluia. The Lord has risen from the dead, alleluia, alleluia. For our sake he died on the cross. The Lord has risen from the dead, alleluia, alleluia. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord has risen from the dead, alleluia, alleluia. In Jesus we see, see one, one who is crowned now with glory and honor, honor because, because he suffered, suffered death. death. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior in the house of David his servant. As he promised by the lips of holy men, those who were his prophets from of old. A Savior who would free us from our foes from the hands of all who hate us. So his love for our fathers is fulfilled and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father to grant us that free from fear and saved from the hands of our foes who might serve him in holiness and justice all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him to make known to his people their salvation, true forgiveness of all their sins, the loving kindness of the heart of our God, who is a source like the dawn from on high. He will give light to those in darkness 
those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In, in Jesus, Jesus we see one, one who is crowned now with glory and honor, and honor because, because he suffered, he suffered death. death. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The response is, send your spirit upon us. Send, send your, your spirit, spirit upon, upon us. us. Let us pray to Christ, who ascended into heaven, to send the Holy Spirit to the apostles. Send your, send your spirit, spirit upon, upon us. us. Lord, pour on us the Holy Spirit, the promise of the Father. Close us with power from on high. Send, send your, your spirit, spirit upon, upon us. us. You wanted all your disciples to be wise as serpents, and yet simple as doves. Teach us by your spirit wisdom and simplicity. Send, send your, your spirit, spirit upon, upon us. us. You are now seated at the right hand of the Father. Intercede for us now as we look to you, our eternal priest. Send your, send spirit, your spirit upon, upon us. us. Let us suffer with you in our time of sorrow. May we rise with you in glory. Send, send your, your spirit, spirit upon, upon us. us. Our Father, who, who art in heaven, heaven hallowed be thy name. Thy, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Lord God, you restore us to eternal life by your Saviour, our Saviour's resurrection. Place us at the, your right hand, where he is enthroned with you. You gave us a new birth and baptism. Clothe us in the garment of eternal happiness when Christ comes in his glory. We make our prayer to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Amen. And may the Lord bless us and keep us safely today and all the days of our life. Amen. Let us say the Pax Christi prayer. Thank you, loving God, for the, for the gift, gift of, of life, life, for this, for this wonderful, wonderful world which we all share, for the joy of love and friendship, for the challenge of helping to build your kingdom. Strengthen my determination to work for a world of peace and justice. My conviction that whatever our nationality or race, we are all global citizens, one in Christ. My courage to, to challenge the, the powerful with the values of the gospel. My, my commitment to find non-violent ways of resolving conflict, conflict personal, personal, local, local national, national and international. international. My, my efforts, efforts to, to forgive injuries and to, to love those I find it hard to love. Teach me to share the gifts you have given me, to speak out for the victims of injustice who have no voice, to reject the violence which runs too much of our world today. Holy Spirit of God, you renew my hope for a world free from the cruelty and evil of war, so that we may all come to share in God's peace and justice. Amen. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.